And in this case, what we have here is a controller and pressure differential valves to control the differential pressure between what is going in upstream of the heat exchanger and going out at downstream of the heat exchanger. So we have the PDC, that means pressure differential controller. It takes a tab at the discharge of the heat exchanger and at the inlet of the control valves. This measurement is sent to a PLC also and the, the output of the PLC goes to two control valves. See that this control loop is different from the arrangement is different from the previous one because now we have a split range control. So part of the signal will actuate in the small valve, control valve, and the, the remaining signal to the, the process will actuate in the biggest control valve. Or it can be the opposite, depends on the control philosophy of the plant. So it's important that you get familiar with that. It can be in the operating manual or eventually in the interlock description of the plant.